right, you guys, we have another very special person here on the wet red carpet. Um, this is Desmond Child, and uh, he's kind of a really big deal because you basically have written every song we've ever been in love with. <laughs> that is the truth. Kind of the truth. Well, I'm sorry, there was one song you didn't one, write. One, Happy Birthday, okay? R okay, that was the one. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> How did you get hooked up with Bon Jovi to begin with? Well, I used to work with Kiss and Paul Stanley, and uh, John asked Paul for my number, and then we got together the first day and wrote You Give Love a Bad Name. I mean, that's not a bad first day, is it? Yeah, first day's work. <laughs> then we wrote Living on a Prayer together, John, Richie, Sambora, and I. That's amazing. So you've gone from giving love a bad name to giving rock and roll a really wonderful day. <laughs> yeah. That's, that's got to feel good. It does feel good. And just, I'm so proud of, of the whole entire band. Everyone's worked so hard to make this band a legend because it really is hard work all these years and they've been so consistent and they just keep writing, keep believing and I'm just happy to be part of the Bon Jovi family. That's incredible. So, I mean, they're obviously quite deserved. Everybody here is a huge Bon Jovi fan. I mean, it's kind of really amazing that you get to spend all this time with them, and I know that everybody's really jealous. So, like, do you have any stories from behind the scenes that you want to share? Like, was there a moment where, I don't know, Somebody fell asleep at the wheel, or I don't know, something. Give me, give me a little oh, behind I remember the once, a long time ago, John was in L.A., and he just didn't have any, anything to do that day for some reason. And I said, oh, and he said, what are you doing? I said, well, I have these appointment, appointments. And he said, okay, I'll drive you. So he drove me to like five appointments and just <laughs> sat in the lobby. It's pretty cool when John Bon Jovi's your chauffeur. That is pretty incredible. Yeah. yeah. That um, was one of the funnest days. How, can we, do you think that you know, we can work that out? Do you think he's got any more <laughs> days off where he's just not doing anything? I don't to, think so. He's gonna be an, <laughs> John Bon Jovi's going to be your next Uber driver. <laughs> After, I mean, where do you go from here? <laughs> it's, yeah. Where do you go from there? <laughs> Once you're inducted into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame, then I feel it's like... Uber. Then it's Uber. <laughs> <laughs> or Lyft. <laughs> Lyft. <laughs> do you have a favorite song that you guys did together? Living on a Prayer. Why? Because it means so much to so many people. And, you know, they always play it at the end of the night and no one will leave until they've heard Living on a Prayer. And when they start to play Living on a Prayer, it's goosebumps. Everyone just screams it out. You can't even hear the band. It means so much to people. It does. And I remember once we got a letter from a guy that said he was going to kill himself. And so he went to the bridge, just jumped out of the car, left the car running, was ready to jump, and Living on a Prayer came on the radio. And he said, oh, well, that's my favorite song. So let that be the last song I hear. So he went back in the car. By the end of the song, he drove home. Oh, wow. So Bon Jovi has saved a life. That is amazing. Yeah, but we get so many letters of people that say our music has, has helped them through hard times. And, you know, so it, and it's a song about hope. Yeah. And that's in such little supply these days. So That's for sure. We need some joy in our lives. Yeah. That's what the Hall of Fame is all about. Adding yeah. a little bit of joy back into the world. Absolutely. <laughs> um, I, I am so happy that you came by. Thank you. Thank you so much for sharing this and with us. I think we match, right? Um, yeah. Did you, did you guys notice? We have a, these, you know, he does collaborations with Bon Jovi, <laughs> but we do collaborations of our own, yeah. all right? Yeah. <laughs>